folk singer, guitar player, actress, theater, director, screenwriter, music engineer, student, and teacher. And she also works as a promotion and social media consultant to WUMB Radio 91.9 FM in Boston. Buffy is also a music producer and has proudly produced a number of recordings for talented singer-songwriters. She has hosted open mics, also taught harmony and <coughs> performance classes, and says that now she also generally hangs around making music with everyone she meets. And today she is solo, because often you will hear her as half of the local legendary country and western duo Fishkin and Groves. Here today to perform solo and her own original songs, which is a treat, we have Buffy Groves. Please give Buffy a round of applause. Thank you, Buffy. Well, this has been <clears throat> wonderful for me. I love spoken word. I love poetry. I also started by falling in love with Shakespeare at a very early age. Yeah, don't do that. Um, and when I write, it is out of the long love affair with language that I have had. And it, that fueled a lot of my theater um, aspirations as well. <coughs> that um, the performance of language is, I think, a, a wonderful way to, to carry meaning. Um, so, I'm going to play a little bit with uh, keys today because everything has to get a little lower. <clears throat> but let's try this. This is something that I wrote um, in high school, the lyric. My brother wrote the music. We collaborate quite a bit. Um, I had a friend in high school, an older girl, who was a Renaissance person. She could draw and sing and, and uh, play instruments. She played the piano and she was in the, in the Boston Ballet Corps and she, she was a poet and it, she was just gorgeous and everything. And I would watch her go through her world and think, oh my gosh. So I wrote this, this poem at the time and I called it a uh, gem, but what it really stood for was green-eyed monster. <laughs> so you see what you think. You have an artist's hands, the swirling ever shifting lands of color found and lost again in half forgotten dreams of paradise are resting warm within your fingertips that you must send them forth in streams flowing into landscapes of a world that only you can see I'll be happy if there are a few that you can share with me fly and as I watch you glide I wonder why I cannot rise up beside you knowing a 
as I do We are more one than two How were we cast to play such different roles? You are there On that I can rely we can share as in your flight i find the skyways you can use my birth to show you back to earth together we can make each other whole you see with poets eyes that view beyond the outward guise The inner truth of what you see Is patterned into scores Of multicolored tapestries With scenes composed of words So perfectly and wholly yours that reading done the tribute i must give you is the knowledge why your poetry evokes in me a smile for you for me a sigh I watch you glide I wonder why I cannot rise up beside you Knowing as I do We are more one than two How were we cast to play such different roles? You are there on that I can rely and we can share as in your flight I find the skyways you can use my birth to show you back to earth together we can make each other Thank you. <clears throat> um, do I dare put the capo even on? So, um, so then I got out of the house, which came very early for me. I uh, I had a, a a home life that wasn't. anything that uh, gave me much reason to stick around. And this came after a few years of knocking around. It's called Home on the Highway. I grew up in a four-room house There was never enough room to breathe Hated school, it was such a drag My father drank and my mother nagged I guess I just wasn't a part of their back inside I began to see put my life in a suitcase 
and quietly take my leave Cause there's a guy kinda shy Smile with my eyes He helped me fly away Out to the highway I found a new home On the highway Welcome home Changed my partners as I changed my ways I kept trying to settle down With friends and strangers and boys in the bands I recall as voices and pairs of no more than a succession of one night stands I was always on my way to the next town over the rainbow Where true love and contentment can be found Cause it seems each time I choose I lose my highway shoes I don't know why I stay here on the highway I'm so at home on the highway Welcome home Took the home of another man He was somehow different again He didn't sweep me off my feet But he was oh so gentle and oh so sweet And it was all over inside of three weeks there was no use trying to pretend Leave a note on the pillow And hope the wounds I leave will mend Cause there's always someone on the run Stick out my thumb, hey, are you going my way? Welcome home <clears throat> Thank you. Okay, I think I have time for one more. And this one my my song gestation time it's l sort of um elephant time it's long often a song will take me many years especially if i write both the words and the music and that was the case with this one this song came out of a songwriting class began there one of Bob Frankie's classes. And um, 
Bob, any of you who've taken classes with Bob know that his methodology is to have you give you the assignment and you come back the next day with the song. Bob gave me the assignment. And five years later, the song was done. Lucky for me, I'm not rule bound. Whatever someone wants me to do. So this song um, sort of sums it all up for me. Um, it's mostly autobiographical. I call it Working in Wood. Feel how she sits like a swan on the surface Rising with each gentle swell The morning fog lifts and the jib tackle shifts As we wake to the call of the bell The scene slips away and I gaze at the ceiling I'd stay in that dream if I could For the memory play brings me back to the days When I first started working in wood So long I drifted, my goal merely motion Till a chance morning's walk changed my plans Transfixed by the scene of sailboats careened And the shipwrights at work on the sand Day after day I came back to the harbor Begging what work they would give Till the captains and crews Saw my calling was true And they taught me a new way to live Fell, float, quarter and plane the strength of the stock can be seen in the grain. Adds, axe, mallet, and pin. The worth of the wood is revealed from stock by the work it must do trim stain varnish and sand our hearts learn to love what we shape with our He saw that his labors were good But when all said and done Knows the carpenter's son He'd as well have been working in Thank you.
I'm walking my dog after dinner. We have found ourselves at the park a few blocks from home. Things are quiet as it has been raining and the dark is descending. Halfway around the walking track, a Muslim family is playing soccer on the field below. Mother is goalie in long pants under a long skirt, layered over with a long tunic. A burqa hoods her head and face. The eldest daughter has come of age. She sports American blue jeans and a t-shirt. She too wears a burqa, though her face is open and bright. Her young sisters in Western dress run around their bearded father, who is barking instruction to run for the ball, pay attention. All of them are moving and laughing and having fun in the dusk, in the park. This makes me happy in that bittersweet way, wishing to find them similarly engaged in the light of day. I'm back at the park with the dog on a bright sunny Sunday afternoon. The family is back too. They've just driven their firstborn to join her soccer team for a game. Her sisters wait in the back of the car for mother and father who stand chatting outside the driver's side door. I am compelled to approach them. I tell them how happy I was to see them together playing, enjoying one another. They smile politely and nodding, thank me, attempting in the tongue of my country to tell me that my dog is nice. Thank you. Don't know where the miles have gone Where the hours have risen and lain These beds of earth that I've rested upon Have been washed like sheets in summer rain I pray for strength to wrestle the snow While leaves of autumn color my brain As days turn to seasons I need to know have I missed your birthday again? Did you pour yourself a tall glass of wine? Turn to the window and whisper a name It'll be alright if it's all in my head Have I missed your birthday again? Hear you warm and safe on your bed A hand to cling to as the darkness wanes But do you wonder why the moon turns red While the wind sounds familiar Like a passing train See the glow of a vagrant fire That warmed my cup in its low blue flame Does your home fire heat match my world desire? Have I missed your birthday again? Did you pour yourself another glass of wine? Turn to the window and whisper a name You've had your life to live and I've had mine Have I missed your birthday? Have I missed your birthday? Have I missed your birthday again? Thank you very much. The essence inside slides, wanders into wonder, and then departs. Wait, watch out the window. The essence is always changing, sliding, arising like noontime light, as clear as first sight. Who am I? 
What do I find when my hands dig deep into the heart of me and essence flows through my fingers like silver water spilling over the lip of a quiet fountain? Who am I and why? Do I call out to the bright blue sky or hide within beneath the lonely cloud which hovers at the edge of silence and the night? I am, no more, no less. I am. A mountain wrapped in purple haze. If only I could go back and misspend my youth. So at the time I wrote that, I think I heard a celebrity talking about his misspent youth or something. I went through the free love generation. I grew up and missed all of it. <laughs> so, <laughs> uh, and I like Jimi Hendrix, too. It's a little nod to Jimi Hendrix in here, so I'll read it again. A mountain wrapped in purple haze. If only I could go back and misspend my youth. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Peach and pear. 